today's a pretty big, massive day. You might be wondering what, uh, what what's going on. Well, if you actually have paid attention to, um, corporate clash news, one point three is getting announced. And usually I would not do these, but today is very special. It's a big, very hype that I have to stream. We are going to read this, and then we're going to watch the stream live. We're going to react to it. Hello, YouTube. I hope you're all having a tuntastic day. Um, um, we are finding out a sneak peek of 1.3. And we did find out some stuff, like there's this Morse code thing stating you're fired and my kitty's next to me and she wants my food no <sighs> stay hydrated all right so we're gonna read this and we're gonna check this out okay the version 1.3.0 update informational video premieres tonight learn more about this upcoming update with over 20 minutes of brand new information Note, this showcase will cover only a fraction of the update's full contents, as the update is truly that large. Rest assured, anything not touched upon in full will be discussed in the near future. So, if you've been on Clash on the site, there's been uh, things going on. So, they've been doing these buildings, um, soundtracks every two weeks. Basically, unique tracks in the buildings. And then they have this one final one. Oh, yeah. Pretty funky. I'll turn it up so you guys can hear it. If you look at the background, it looks all brownish-like. There's some stairs I see. Um, yeah. Got some pillars. But we already have Lawbots uh, revamped, so it can't be Lawbots. The color just reminds me of boss fights. Now, if we go to this OST. Now this is interesting. Stock up your anti-bear tune spray. If you look at the bottom, there's Morse code right there. What does that translate to? Well, according to the comments, you're fired over and over and over again. So, if you recall in Toontown lore, there is fires, and the fires launches the cogs into a cannon and leaves them out. And how do you get it? By fighting the CEO. So, we must be thinking, boss bots are getting revamped, you know? Make sure to stay hydrated, by the way. I, I got some water. Don't worry. I have water to stay hydrated during this because this is going to be quite an event. As you can see here, I have an asexual cape on. So last month they uh, launched uh, the pride stuff. Um, asexual pride all the way, but I did get them all on this tune because why not? Um, but I only am showing the one that I, I'm mainly known for, uh, which is asexual. Now, I, I would also wear the non-binary or trans, you know. But I am mostly known for being ase asexual, you know. Wait, is it kind of foggy? Huh. Okay, we gotta pull this up now. Okay, premiere will begin shortly. Oh, stay hydrated. It's like, um, I'm Fred from Spongebob. My eyes! Sorry if that was loud. 
All right, here we go. Known as the Hires and Heroes update. Hires and Heroes. Man, I have been waiting a long a lava time lamp. to say that, but I can assure you that the version 1.3 update is, without a doubt, by far our largest and most expansive release. Unlike 1.2? than both the 1.1 and 1.2 Ooh. I'm pleased to tell you that despite the lengthiness of this video, the content discussed in today's video really only covers, I'd say, around a half of the- I'm nervous. It looks like a dine-in service. Initially, this update was intended to be of a smaller caliber with a target date of, uh, last July. Oof. Yep. Yeah, I was gonna say. Right. A full year ago was the initial target date. Wow. When you load version 1.3, you'll be greeted with a brand Whoa. new game menu across the- Whoa! Whoa! At the far left of the screen is the new chat panel. When opening the chat panel, it expands into a new modernized Ooh. Chat now capable of slash command support. This chat log features several tabs for filtering chat. A main tab which displays all chat history from the current I like that. A whispers tab which Oh, that's so good. An alerts tab which displays alerts such as invasions and Okay. An NPC tab which displays only NPC <gasps> Yes. Reading. Thank you. Which we'll get to later. Oh, okay. For a moment, features a dedicated unite drop down <gasps> for quick access. Ooh, unites the right chat. there. You'll yes. You don't have to worry about accidentally uniting when training doodles ever again. <laughs> that little star button you asked? Yeah. Don't Favorites. Forget, you'll learn about it soon. Favorites. For now, uh, let's turn no. Over to the right side of the screen. Okay. What do we got? Menus, such as the notification panel, which displays oh. requests, group invites, and more. Please note that everything in this trailer is subject to change. It's all Cap. a work in progress. Gotcha. All right, folks, let's go ahead and get started with the social panel. So, sitting in the chair. Go ahead and crack open the new social button sitting on the top right. Screen. Online friends. And the first thing that you're going to notice is Search. That, well, the window that opens up is probably a lot larger than you were expecting. Yeah. Like what do we got? Such as, hey, now you finally have a proper scroll bar to create Thank God. For your entire friends list. When I first started playing Corporate Clash back in 2018, I was a bit upset by the lack of solution for being able to easily find people to run buildings, facilities, and bosses with. Yeah. The best solution that we had at the time was a little channel in the game's Discord server, which I'm sure a handful of you might remember. Mm -hmm. But finally, four years later, I'm proud to finally present a new in-game solution. Oh. In the version 1.3 update, Corporate Clash will finally have an in-game group track. No way. No holds barred. Oh my god! Like boarding groups. In a whole new way. Yes! Been now removed entirely and integrated with this new Oh, system. that's so good! improved compared to boarding groups. First, groups are game-wide. You can join any group on the group tracker as long as you're in a safe area. For example, while you have to be in Cellbot HQ... And you can filter it, too! You don't necessarily have to be in Cellbot HQ to join that DP group. You don't even have to be in the same district as long as you are I don't have to do Toon HQ anymore! Oh my god! You could chat directly with other members of a group using the And it's log. you could put tier one and stuff. The filter also allows you to search for groups of any type in any location. I love this. Oh, and before I forget, you can also now create groups for cog buildings, racing, golfing, trolley, table games, and fishing. I'll also go ahead and invite one of my friends to the group too. The quick invite menu <gasps> here will allow you to invite Yes continuously upon the group's creation. And once I'm good to go, That's handy if you're on Discord. From here, I'm now taking like with your friends in a call. My group. I can see the status of the chains that have been invited, and by pressing the little drop down arrows, I can yes! Well. Oh my god. As a group owner, any tunes that I invite will have space reserved for them in the group. Oh, we can take a look and at their gags. else would not reserve room for other tunes. That just about wraps up my segment here for the group tracker. Wait, 145 I'm laugh? As for it as I am, because this has been a long time. Huh. Ago. You're you right. right. now is a product of nearly a year's worth of development. Let's talk about clubs. The clubs. clubs back in 2018 for a sense of community. Are these like players. clubhouses that you go to? Let's get into what that new club experience is all about. To get started with making a club, let's pay a visit to Whoa, clubs. look at the desk. Inside, you'll see a new centerpiece run by both an old friend and someone new. Yeah, club Go meeting halls or something. Yeah, it looks like it. The brother Bro Vinci in tow to help us tunes team up and stop the cogs. Doe will be able to help you create your club. Simply pick a name and a <gasps> to start out with. Oh, look at that! Beans later, you'll have yourself a club. As a side note, multiple clubs can indeed have the same name. Okay. Once that's done, pop open your friends list, click on the drop-down menu, and invite whoever you'd like. Okay. When in a club, your club will be visible in the all-new social panel. Got it. Last tab. On the main tab here, you'll get an overview of the task purchase. Club name, 
boosters. Level, experience and description. Boosters, which give tunes temporary boosts to various stats, have been divided into multiple categories, encouraging collaboration oh. with other clubmates as clubs decide which booster would be best. Each booster lasts 48 hours. <gasps> oh, people are going to be using the department and merits and rewards. Yes. To a maximum of three boosters at a time. Ooh, booster Ooh, booster slots. Yes. Maximizing rewards. Personalization tab. Ah! To invest in their I love it. With over 100 unique emblems to choose from and over 500,000 unique customization combinations for the Look party, at all that. Clubs are Chat commands can be used to perform special shortcuts. For example, when you're in a safe area, you can use the slash TP command to warp to any playground that you have teleport access to without having to go through Wait, the Wait, what? Mode. Oh! Also... Stickers! Oh! Tunes are free to choose from a wide range of 16 toony stickers. Okay, those are cute. Every to express your true feelings for another tune in game. Aww. Express your anger when things don't go according to plan. I love it. Make friends with the new players in Toontown Central. But Where's wait, the crying laughter face? Are you not satisfied with the number of stickers in your life? Yeah. Do you feel stifled by the limitations of only 16 emotions? Yes. Through special means, you can unlock up to 16 additional unique stickers. That's a whopping 32 Ooh. emotions in total. We're not only going to be catering towards players in the end game, or even one cog department for that matter. Oh. Instead, we'll be expanding on the game in ways that will affect all players, both new and old. Every single stage of the game will be affected by this update. Wow! So, if you have a new tune, a mid-tier tune, a high-level tune, or even a maxed-out tune, Woo. you're going to want to hop on to Toontown Corporate Clash and experience everything that this yeah. game has to offer. So here's just a few things to keep you on the edge of your seat. Okay. The 1.3 update will include, but is definitely not limited to, tune level cap being increased to level 85, <gasps> the maximum laugh capacity Whoa. being increased to 150, a brand new way to experience playgrounds, what? various new areas to explore oh? and enjoy, new eyelash variants, Ooh. HD cog models, and oh! yes, scale cogs included, reworked animations, okay. drag rebalances, and so much more. Ah! So if I were to talk about everything to come with this update, we'd seriously be here for hours. And that's about it for everything we wanted to cover for today. Woo! Testing server available <gasps> to our corporate clash partners. Woo! This is to help verify that all the features are smooth and stable, ensuring- I'm planning on use. applying one of these days. While the server will not be accessible to the public, partners will be allowed to stream gameplay on the server. What? To share their experience Lucky! If you're a corporate clash partner out there listening in, you'll be granted access as soon as it's ready. Fine! In addition, we will be inviting a select few members from the community. Oh. We will be reaching out to these people soon, though do note we won't be considering any more invites past our initial batch. Okay. There's one more thing, isn't it? Okay, I think the trailer is over now. Oh, wait! Oh, okay, what we got, what we got? Anyone want to go fight PS? Who's P What's PS? Oh. Okay, what is it? Whoa. Ah, they, they, they tricked us. Oh, man. That was dope. Oh. Cliffhanger. PS, PS. Wait, post Gator's office? PlayStation fight? PlayStation boss? Oh! Pace setter's office? Oh, you're right! I think it's probably like a pace setter's office, like you said. Pace setter. What does it mean to be a pace setter? A person, group, or organization that is most progressive or successful and serves a model to be intimidated. So... I guess I'll see y'all next time. Hope y'all have a good one. Bye-bye.